Hi, welcome to solutionwizard.com. In this video, we are going to learn how to install Oracle Database 12 Series 2 on Windows 10 Professional 64 bit. Oracle Database 12 C is an ideal cloud system for cloud environment and it is the multi tenant architecture enable function as multi tenant container database CDB. A CDB includes 0, 1, or many pluggable database PDBS. A PDBS is a portable collection of schema, schema object, and non schema object that appear to an Oracle Net client as a non CDB. All Oracle databases before 12C are non CDBS. A container is a logical collection of data or metadata within the multi tenant architecture. Multi tenant architecture solve a number of problems posed by the traditional non CDB architecture. Oracle multi tenant option enable you to consolidate data and code without altering existing schemas and application. Drive from the storing the data and metadata specific to a PDB in the PDB itself rather than a storing all dictionary metadata in one place. Go to install Oracle Database 12 C release to on Windows 10 Professional 64 bit. But sorry to say, Oracle Database 12 C are not available for 32 bit operating system. If you are using any version than other Windows 10 Professional, then also follow this tutorial as installing Oracle Database 12 C release 2 are the same. In order to install the Oracle 12 C, I have to download the software, which you can do by visiting the Oracle website. Go to the oracle.com download, then select Oracle database after that you will be here on the download page. Here you can see all the available edition of Oracle 12 C is listed. Choose the one which you needed. For this, it will choose the Oracle Database 12 C release 2, a standard edition 2, and enterprise edition. I will download this file from the first option, which is Microsoft Windows 64 bit. As I am installing the software on Windows 10 Professional 64 bit, if you click that See All link, you will be here on the Oracle Database 12 C download pages. Here, accept the Audion license agreement and download this file from the oracle to download this file you will need it to sign into the oracle website if you have a valid account on this site it's good otherwise you can register yourself here and create an account which is free after filling the username and password when you click the sign in button the file download automatically i have already downloaded this file you can see the content of gift thus i need to first extract this content that's it now I start the setup and install the Oracle Database 12C on my Windows 10. Come to Database folder, open Setup file. Right click the Setup file and choose Run as Administrator. This will start your Oracle Universal Installer. Sometime you face this type of problem, don't worry. If you get this type of error, please check your user permission and upgrade it full control and then install started. For more help, visit my channel and watch the tutorial how to fix or upgrade user permission on Windows 10. The video link is available in the description section. So start. Environment Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 8.1, Windows 10, Windows Server 2012, Windows Server 2012 Release 2. Minimum requirement 10 GB free disk space, 2 GB RAM, but 4 GB is enough. At first, you need to provide your email address if you want to receive all notification and news alert from Oracle. If you do not want it, then all field empty and move to next. Accept this warning as it is just to remind you that you don't provide the email address. Skip and next. On this step, the three different installation option. You can choose any of them according to your need. In my case, I want to install Oracle software and want to create a database. I will choose the first option. If you choose the second option, then only Oracle software install and no database created. You can create a database after the installation of Oracle using DBCA. You can go with the next option if you want to preform the upgrade of the database and software. I choose the first option and next. 
in this step you have to choose between server class and desktop class if you are installing this oracle database 12c on your system the first option which is desktop class if you are installing this oracle database 12c on server which is capable enough to handle the load of all the server component and processes then choose the second option which is server class i am installing Oracle Database 12C on Windows 10 64-bit professional which is installed on my PC thus I will choose the first option and next. Till now the installation was same to the installation of the Oracle 10G 11G but here we have a different step. In this step we need to select or create a Windows user account for Oracle Database 12C. This account must be a standard or say limited account not administrative you. You can see here four option. First using virtual account. Second to let us see existing windows standard user if you have any. Using third will we can create a standard windows user which will be later assigned as oracle home as a choosing oracle home from the windows built in default user and the fourth use windows built in account. I will go the third option and create a windows standard user and use it is my oracle home. I will name my oracle home user as solution wizard and will give it a valid password. Press next and go to the next step. This step you can configure the database setting of your database. For example, using first three text field, you can set the Oracle base location, software location, which will be your Oracle home and database file location, which will be the location where Oracle server will store all your important files such as data file, control file, and radio log file etc. Be careful while setting them the default location, thus won't change them using database addition drop down list. You can choose which database version you want to install. It is Enterprise Edition. Next is Character Set. Let it be set on the default, but if you want to, you can change it. Next field is Global Database Name. It is the name of your database server as database SID. You will need to make connection with your database using tool like SQL Developer. By default, it is set as ORC. If you want to change it and give any other name, but make sure it remember it. The next two field you have to give the password. Be careful, write it down somewhere and remember it. This will be the password for your sys user or system user. Let's fill up it. Make sure check the create as a container database checkbox. This option create your database as a container database CDB that can support more than 250 pluggable database. Next is pluggable database name. Here you have the specify unique name of your pluggable database that default name which is ORCLPDB. So let's next don't worry about this warning. It is just saying that you the password which you just entered is not as per the Oracle password standard. You can read this warning. Click yes and go ahead. Now OEY will check for the prerequisites such as hardware compatibility. If everything goes well then we will be go to install it. If there is any error then OEY will show you here. Luckily no error. Here you can see all the important information regarding our Oracle database such as global database name SID of our database location of the parameter file i suggest you to save this all data somewhere now install doing so we will start the installation thus installation takes some time depend on your hardware like processor speed ram capacity etc this process consumes some time i show first this process and the link of our enterprise manager i suggest you to save this all data and link somewhere Click OK and this installation is successfully done. Now we feel free to close OUI. That's all. We have to install Oracle Database 12 c release 2 on Windows 10 professional 64-bit environment. You can check all tutorial of my channel. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friend on your social media. You can tell me how you like this video by leaving a comment down below and follow me, the Solution Wizard. Thanks for watching this video and you take care of yourself. It is Solution Wizard.